Hello students, today we are going to start with unit number two, which is our senses. In this unit, we are going to study sight, hearing, touch, smell, taste, and how to look after your senses. Sight. You use your sight to distinguish the shape, color, and size of objects. You can only see if there is light. How does it work? The retina captures light from objects. The optic nerve sends this information to the brain. Here you are a picture of an external eye, where you can see the eyebrow, iris, pupil, eyelash, and eyelid. And here you are a picture of the internal eye, where you can see the optic nerve, the lens, the iris, cornea, pupil, and retina. Hearing. You use your sense of hearing to distinguish different sounds. How does it work? The pinna captures the sound. The sound travels through the ear canal to the eardrum. The eardrum makes the small bones vibrate, and the cochlea receives that vibration. The auditory nerve takes that information to the brain. Here you are a picture of the ear. The sound goes through the pinna, ear canal, eardrum, small bones, cochlea, and finally the auditory nerve. Touch. You use your sense of touch to identify characteristics of objects. How does it work? The skin is the sense organ of touch. Touch receptors in your skin send information to the brain. This is a picture of a skin, where you can see hairs, touch receptors, and the nerve. Smell. You use your sense of smell to distinguish smells. How does it work? Smells enter the nostrils and reach the olfactory epithelium inside the nasal cavity. Smell receptors in the epithelium send signals to the olfactory bulb in the brain. Here you are a picture of the nose where you can see the different parts, olfactory nerve, nasal cavity, olfactory bulb, olfactory epithelium, and nostrils. Taste. You use your sense of taste to capture different flavors of foods. How does it work? Taste buds in your tongue capture flavors. Flavors are sweet, salty, sour, bitter, and umami. This is a picture of your tongue where you can see the taste buds. Here you are some tips to look after your eyes. Don't touch your eyes with dirty hands. Make sure there is enough light when you read or study. Don't look directly at the sun. Protect your eyes with sunglasses in strong sunlight in the mountains and on the beach. And use goggles in the swimming pool. This is your pediatrician for an eye test. And here you are some tips to look after your ears. Practice good hygiene. Protect your ears and remember loud noises can damage your ears. And this is the end of the lesson, kids. Remember, watch it as many times as you need. And you can stop it and watch it again, okay? Bye-bye.